Well, we warned you that it wasn't going to be uh, an election night that you're used to, and guess what? This is not the election night that you're used to. Look at that margin, basically 15 percentage points with 64% of the vote counted. But Adrian, advanced voting, mail-in ballots among the last to be tabulated. I'm here to tell you tonight, we believe we're on track to win this election. We were getting ready to win this election. Frankly, we did win this election. <laughs> An edge of your seat election night is now moving into a very uncertain early morning after. This afternoon, the Trump campaign filed a lawsuit to stop the counting of ballots in Pennsylvania. Tonight, Democrat Joe Biden pulling within striking distance of an electoral win as a handful of battleground states continue to count millions of votes. Joe Biden is inching closer to taking the White House, and for Donald Trump, the path to victory is narrowing. Who knows if somebody voted 10 times, two times? How can they vote 10 times? How can they get 10 ballots? Where, I don't know. Where do you, they get, they I don't know. Get. Our goal here in Clark County is not to count fast. We want to make sure that we're being accurate. We have no doubt that when the count is finished, Senator Harris and I will be declared the winners. So I ask everyone to stay calm, all the people to stay calm. The process is working. Tonight, from Donald Trump, defiance. Speaking to reporters at the White House with a list of grievances and Trump's rationale for why he's losing. If you count the legal votes, I easily win. If you count the illegal votes, they can try to steal the election from us. In an election that has seen a record-breaking number of votes cast, the race to 270 enters its fourth day as the world watches and waits. Is, is that really just three days? Yeah, it doesn't feel like it. No. <laughs> yeah, and, and I mean, I guess the great tragedy here is that the longer the outcome is uncertain, uh, the riper the opportunity. I mean, we saw Trump speaking right there, right? Mm -hmm. for, for disinformation, for lies, for rumors to circulate. Stop. Yeah, imagine that woman who believes that there are people out there who voted 10 times. She has no evidence, mm -hmm. right? Um, but if you feel that way, imagine how angry you'd be about what was going on. I was thinking, you know, a month ago, years from now, we'll tell people about that year when people were wearing masks on the street. It'll also be that year mm -hmm. when it took four or five or 10 days <laughs> to find <laughs> out so. who the next president of the United States right. will be. That and murder hornets. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.